Hi guys and welcome back to the Mar Brothers. Today with this beautiful house, Frontline Golf Los Naranjos. But before I say more, check out the drone shot. There's no denying what we want There's no denying what we want Playing games though There's no denying what we want All right, welcome in from the main door of this beautiful Frontline Golf Villa. Let me quickly note, we're celebrating because it's the first Frontline Golf Villa that we're filming. If you love the drone shots as much as we did, comment below. Let's start right off. Upstairs, four bedrooms, downstairs, in the basement, three, and this gorgeous living room will come to that in a second. From here, we go immediately to the kitchen. To my left, a guest toilet. To my right, a lot of cupboard space. Let's go. Now this is New Ordinary Kitchen. It was designed by GD Arredamenti, an Italian company, which have done a gorgeous job. It's so elegant and so present with this kitchen aisle, also serving as a little bar, and top appliances by Gaggenau 400 series. Beautiful, I can totally see someone cooking right over here, being able to see the dining table and also the living room. Great visibility from here, let's move on. right over to this gorgeous dinner table. Now, the glass, great choice because it's see-through. It gives a feeling of space, great. And from here, communication to the kitchen, visibility outwards, super duper. Now from here, let's move on to the living room. I just quickly wanted to point out that the furniture here in the house are from in Italian companies like Gervasoni, Sovet or Meridiana. So the furniture is tip top, high quality, best of the line. That's why it looks so beautiful. I'm sure you agree. I wanted to quickly point out this big marble plastering here, the square in which the niche holds this beautiful television. It's the same marble that's been installed in the kitchen. A nice contrast between the kitchen and this living room. Great that they went from the same materials. You also have a chimney right over here. Fantastic. And moving forward, right behind me, we have the office space. Now what's great about it, they installed these factory style windows with a lot of visibility in and out, meaning there's a better feeling of space around the house. Follow me. All right, this room is great for someone who likes to do business. Sit here, write your million dollar contracts, store your paperwork in one of these storage rooms right over here. You have a gallery wall, a lot of LED lights installed on in the house. Great sitting area for someone to be able to also observe the kitchen, dining area, living room, and the outside area. Fantastic, from here, let's move forward, nice, Easy chair right here. I could imagine myself as a kid sitting here doing the homework whilst I look at one of my parents working. Follow me as I quickly show you something of interest. Now, these Gigaser Italian porcelain tiles are laid out throughout the entire house and they have this glossy shine about them where the light reflects on them and makes this entire floor look super elegant in combination with the Italian brands of furniture here. Beautiful. From here, let's go upstairs to show you the four bedrooms that we have. Right, let's go. Now, the beauty of this house continues on this floor. We have two bedrooms that face southwest and two bedrooms that are on the left and on the right. And we're gonna start with the master bedroom. It's gonna be a pleasure to show it to you. Let's go. Wow. 
What you might not have seen yet is this beautiful frame that gives this gorgeous vista outside. You lie in the bed and you've got this big window, panoramic views to greenery and even the ocean. Fantastic. And from here, let me point out these cupboards, everything with heavy duty oak, dark in contrast to the shiny porcelain, beautiful. You open it up, you immediately have the LED light that pops up. You can hang your Dolce & Cabana goods right over here. Let it be displayed with this beautiful light. And because this is a crystal, you can see through it. You'll be able to look at the beautiful clothing. Before we move on, this bed frame is amazing. Colored gray and black matching to the interior of this room. And then we move forward from the bedroom to this subdivision. Right over here, we have the bathroom. They again used a crystal door see-through to allow the feeling of space here. Let me show it to you. I'm lying in this bathtub. I can see the ocean from here and the nature, but I also noticed Dornbracht bathroom fixtures right here. Dornbracht are like the Mercedes-Benz of bathroom fixtures and they are installed in the entire house and all bathroom. That's amazing. Now let's move on. I would love to show you outside. Let's rock and roll. Now moving forward, you can also close this section with the curtains, but now let me show you outside in this beautiful open terrace right over here. Now the terrace can be used by the main bedroom and also by the bedroom to the left. You've got a lot of easy chair chill out zones right over here. There you have two sun beds. But most importantly, if you just turn a camera and you observe the beauty of this view, open panoramic greenery view, gorgeous. Now keep focusing on that view whilst I open the curtains and welcome you in to bedroom number two. All right, before we move on to the bathroom, quickly wanted to point out this amazing wallpaper bed frame right over here with this embraided material. It's the same that's also placed right over here in between the framing of the oak cupboard wall. And right here, as you can see, a lot of cupboard space. This is the doorway to another galaxy. Just let me sh shut that down really quickly before we beam out. A lot of space as you can see and you have two of them. One, two. All right, from here, time for the bathroom. Let's go. I wanted to point something out in this bathroom and that is the wallpaper right here. It's humidity resistant wallpaper and I've not yet seen a house with wallpaper in the bathroom. Now that just adds the little detail to make this bathroom and entire house a bit more elegant. You've got double sink, floating vanity, Dornbracht sinks here, fantastic. All right, see the rest for yourself and I'll catch you outside for bedroom number three. Gorgeous bedroom and a nice bathroom. Now it's time to show you bedroom number two, uh, three and four. We have number three there, see it. All right, and we have bedroom number four. And now we're back here and we have one bathroom that's right in front of me and that's to be shared by these two bedrooms. See it. Great, right? From here, let's go downstairs. There is still a basement for me to show you. Let's rock and roll. Oh, before we do, how elegant is this? The chandelier hanging, the glass balustrade right over here, the oak stairs leading down. Great. All right, see you downstairs. Basement time. Firstly, let's focus on this beautiful use of space where they made a bodega inside. The coolest room, by the way. Inside, a lot of space to put your wines, and I've noticed they have a Ribera del Duero wine, which it's a region from where the best wines in Spain come from. Fantastic. From here onwards, my favorite room. Now, I'm someone who loves to watch movies. Patrick and I, we actually binge them, don't we? Yes, we do. And sometimes days pass by like this. Before we know it, a week has gone. We've just watched an entire TV show. 
That's why we appreciate rooms like this a lot. All right, what a beautiful cinema room. Now, what I like about it the most, it's isolated from the rest of the house, giving you the privacy, but also the comfort of not being disturbed when you binge watch your favorite television show right here. Or maybe a Mario Brothers property tour, who knows? I'm from here, guys. Oh, really quickly, the carpet is amazing. Also very cozy to walk on, adding to the coziness of this room. Now, continuing, if you're not a lazy potato and you don't want to binge watch, you have something to keep you entertained and that's a germ section right over here. See it for yourself, I'm gonna open it up. So, let's leave this germ section. There's still a lot to show you in the basement right here. Let's go. Coming out of the cinema room, let's go to bedroom number one on this floor. As you can see, there's a lot of light in this bedroom. That means you are not in darkness. Although this is the basement, you have lights coming in from everywhere. And I'm talking about natural light due to this big window that's facing out. Now in the basement, the same qualities have been implied throughout like this beautiful oak wardrobe again with the LED light that goes on. A lot of quality embedded here in the basement as well. Now let's move on. There's bedroom number two to show you. Let's go. Before we go to bedroom number two and three, this is the shared bathroom. See it. All right, from here we have two bedrooms to show you. One room hasn't yet been transformed into a bedroom because you get to choose what to do with it. This room can be any kind of desire. You have a lot of space here, a lot of natural light coming in from here. Can be a bedroom, can be another games room, can be a working room, and can just be an empty room in case you ever need to transform it into something that you don't have yet. And from now, we still have one bedroom to look at. Let's go. Okay, from here, we have the laundry room. Laundry room, super important in a house like that. Let's look at it. Laundry room, all right. With 540 square meters, you'll be washing a lot of things. So you've got washing machine, dryer, you've got this entire room that's only meant to be used for the laundry. A lot of cupboard space, sink, natural light coming in. Great, and it's also very nice and cool here. From here, last bedroom to look at, follow me. All right, last bedroom, right over here. See it, let's go. This could be the service room. This could be a guest apartment. Whatever you desire, you are right here in a beautiful room. Once again, quality throughout, even in the basement where most people go cheap, but here, nothing is cheap. Again, beautiful oak cupboards right here. The same LED lights that pop up. Everything is fantastic in this room and you have a lot of natural light coming in. From here, guys, let's move out and let me show you upstairs what the garage upstairs our garage as you can see you have a garage for two cars some extra room for storage and also this beautiful driveway up from where you enter and also have the ability to park your cars here staircase leading up to the garden it has it all see it for yourself toilet I meant bathroom. Hope you enjoyed that. From here we go upstairs to the first floor, outside to the garden. Let's go. That's it with the basement guys. We're now walking up and upstairs. I'm gonna be showing you the beautiful garden area. For those who have stayed tuned for this entire time, thank you so much, all the love to you guys. And I'm so happy that you decided to tune in. And from here, let's go outside. Let me show you the beauty right there. 
partially covered, let's put focus on this Benchmade one piece wooden dining table. Once again, you've got eight chairs and it's right outside the kitchen. You cook, you bring the food out, you eat here, you've got a beautiful view. Moving on, you've also got this really nice sitting area right over here. It explains itself. Great area, glass balustrade to keep the view open. All right, now we're going down the stairs and I would quickly like to show you the outdoor kitchen area. You've got another section right over here. And because you have so much sun and so much beautiful days in Spain, you will be using this kitchen outside a lot. You've got a barbecue, you've got a sink, and a nice area to sit and chill or cook. You've also got a fridge right here. It's been thought of. And moving on from here, you've seen the pool in the drone shots. The pool is heated. You can jump in it in the winter time. It'll be nice and warm. I love that. Most houses don't have a heated pool. They have it pre-installed, which kind of sucks because you make the new buyer go through the hassle of installing it. And now, as we use this time to quickly look at this beautiful straight lined house and how well it's been refurbed and how beautifully it actually presents itself. Right? Do you agree, Patrick? Yes, I do. <laughs> this is, yes, I do is all I hear from my brother who's doing the camera work today. Focus on this niche right over here. It's actually beautiful because you also have a fireplace right here, a lot of sitting area and this beautiful view out to the greenery and the golf course. And of course, this water feature that goes around this socket here. So, I think I'm gonna round it up. I'm gonna pop over here so that you can see the beautiful house right behind me and tell you guys that it is on the market. It's just been released the other day and a lot of interest has already been shed on this beautiful house. So if you would be interested in seeing this property or even buying it, make sure you contact us. The details are below. This was a Maru Brothers production and it was our pleasure to show you once again a beautiful house, this time frontline Los Naranjos Golf. Right, I'm out. Take good care and see you guys in the next video. Arrivederci.